Hello friends, I am Shushant Raghavan. Welcome to Technical and Quality Session. For understanding the technical requirements and quality standards in clothing industry, making a sustainable garment, I have good practical experience in the apparel manufacturing sector. My skills are CAD pattern making, sample development, technical requirements, and measuring quality performance. Today's session is about statistical data analysis in apparel industry. For more sessions like this, do like and subscribe to my channel. Now let's begin the presentation. Statistical data analysis, managing quality in a better way. What is statistical analysis? Statistical analysis is a scientific tool that helps collect and analyze large amounts of data to identify common patterns and trends to convert them into meaningful information. In simple words, statistical analysis is a data analysis tool that helps draw meaningful conclusion from raw and unstructured data. The conclusions are drawn using statistical analysis, facilitating decision making and helping businesses make future predictions on the basis of past trends. Statistical analysis involves working with numbers and is used by businesses and other institutions to make use of data to derive meaningful information. Statistical analysis in quality management. The supply chain in the apparel industry has become more complicated since companies have been seeking for lower cost and they have started to source their suppliers all over the globe. That brought the need for designing a better control system of an already very complicated supply network. In order to have a record for the QA performance of every supplier, statistical data analysis is necessary to be obtained. Getting necessary data that will describe the real QA situation in the company can be ensured by designing sufficient supporting documentation. One of the key documents is the inspection report. The inspection report should contain information which after analysis can give a clear picture for the quality status in the company. The following table presents the most important information that one QC report needs to have. Suppliers, supplier name, location, capacity, daily output, time, approval date, Inspection date, delivery date, quality, number of defects per piece, number of defects per order, number of defective pieces, number of defective orders, types of defects, product, product type, style number, order number, quantity, color size, cost, inspector name, department, comments, suggestion for problem solving, picture attachments. The information from the QC report can be digitalized and incorporated into the ERP system of the company. Digital version of the QC report should be able to satisfy the needs for providing the necessary information and making the work process easier. The following picture illustrates an IT solution as QA support in the company. QA IT support software solution statistical report. The statistical analysis report can present the supply performance in terms of quality during the last six months or one year. That will help the QA manager to have visual image about suppliers who have had bad performance during the last period. To know the biggest quality problems or the most problematic product types, period analysis can be done based on data collected from quality inspection reports. On the other side, the analysis can locate problems related to quality inspectors and their performance. You can do an analysis based on the last three months data. Following parameters can be considered while collecting data. You can use multiple forms instead of one. Later make matrices for supply performance on various parameters. Number of orders per supplier. Number of pieces per supplier. Cost of orders. Type of products per supplier. Number of RTS orders. Number of defective pieces. Type of defective product types. Color sizes. Types of defects, defect analysis, number of defects per piece, number of defects per order, supplier name responsible for low quality, inspected orders per QC inspector, inspected quantity per QC inspector, travel distance to supplier per QC inspector, type of products per QC inspector. By knowing the existing quality problems, it's much easier to locate the problem causes and come up with a solution for problem solving. 
every company has several key performance indicators to judge overall performance and statistical data analysis is the primary strategy for finding those accurate metrics for internal or team metrics you will want to measure data like associated deals and revenue hours worked trainings completed and other meaningful numerical values it is easy to collect this data but to make meaning of it you will want to statistically analyze the data to assess the performance of individuals teams and the company statistically analyzing your team is important not only because it helps you to hold them accountable but also because it ensures their performance is measured by unbiased numerical standards rather than opinions thank you for watching for more sessions like this do like and subscribe to my channel please comment your valuable thoughts and don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified when i post a new presentation bye have a good day